This is kind of nuts, guys, but we're going to have to take the emergency stim. Ow! But it's good. Go, grab, run, or climb. Look, Ma, no hands. Um, nom, 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 nom. Good morning, survivors. Polly Jr. here. And welcome back to the long dark. We're picking up where we left off here after the end of the last episode. We're here in the Angler's Den in the Ash Canyon. And it is, uh, oh gosh, late morning. I slept in. Of course, we needed to get a good night's rest because we have a, a few ropes to climb today <laughs> to get to the gold mine where we will find the technical backpack and the crampons and possibly some other stuff. So, Hope nobody needs this anymore. Nobody needs it, pal. Take it. Yours now. Throw it on the stove here. Ooh, can't do it yet. Um, in fact, let's do this. I did pare down the pack somewhat, dropped a few things that we don't need um, for this particular trip. Although I'm going to grab a book and a dice. I saw some papers down here. I'm going to make a new plug. There we go. Because I think we're down to just one plug left if memory serves. So let's get a little fire started here. We're going to make one more coffee. Yeah, something hot for the trip. Oh, we do have two cattails, my bad. Anyway, all right, we'll use that one. And a book, 100% chance. Get it started. I hate to spend the time doing this, but I only have two coffees. And I'd like to have at least one coffee for each rope climb because it takes a lot out of you. Saps all your strength and your energy and all that fun stuff. So, we don't want to fall asleep halfway out the rope, do we? Bunch wood. No, that would be bad. <laughs> Let's throw in, uh, we'll throw in one... I don't really even need that, do we? Got some reclaimed here. How long does it take to make a coffee? Not too long, does it? Let's grab the pot. Where's that beautiful pot? Right there. And we'll make up one last coffee. Nine minutes. Not too shabby. And while that's cooking up, let's go ahead and eat. Um, wow, we're running really low on food. I ate the dog food last night. Woke up in the middle of the night. And then went back to bed. <laughs> Beggars can't be choosy. Let's uh, let's clean the handgun. That's nine minutes. Yeah, sun is going up. We got to get to this gold mine and then get back either here or continue on um, to the uh, the cabin that was up on that cliff. I think we're going to be able to get there this time. I think I know how to do it. Now let's um, yeah, let's drink it. Let's go. There's no time like the present. I'm not going to need that pot, and I don't need an extra can. Let's drop the cans. Nice and light, 63 out of 77. That's relatively light anyway. Okay, we're looking good. So, yeah. All right, let's roll out to the gold mine. There are three kinds of people in this world. Those that can count, and those that can't. Uh, I need one more coffee. I wanted three coffees. I made three, and but I, I drank the third, so we need one more. I'm just going to pass the time, and then we're going to take it. Do not drink it. And that was perfect. I meant to do that. All right, out we go. Okay. So, let's get a move on. Now that we are ready, we got three coffees to climb the ropes. And according to my calculations, the rope is going to be somewhere to the west, northwest-ish. Um... At least that's what the map says. We're not going to follow the river anymore. We're going to cut through and go toward those cliffs. So I'm pretty sure that's where the rope is. The first rope. I think we've got two or th maybe even three rope climbs. I'm not exactly sure. I'm going to grab some more of these, actually. We're going to have to eat them because we're running out of food. Excellent. All right. Now, I just heard some wolves. I thought we were done with the wolves, but apparently not. Now, does it, is it just me, or does it look like these trees all burned? Is that from the, from the plane crash? I don't see any pieces of plane over here. So, I don't know, it might have just been a uh, standard old forest fire. Now we know why they call it Ash Canyon. I guess that makes sense. I don't think that's it, I think that's more to the south. Definitely want to be on this side of the river. But I did hear a wolf over here. Oh, boy. Yep. Yep. There's at least one. Might even be two. Okay. We don't want to go toward the waterfall. I want to stay to the left of the waterfall. All right. So over there somewhere. We're going to try to get around him and head up here. Whoa. Whoa. 
Oh boy. There's one right in our path. This is not good. I don't see him. I heard him. Practically stepped on him. Oh. <laughs> Great. All right, here we go. Oh, this guy's charging. But not like the other one the other day. That came right at us and attacked. That one's just bolting. 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 Yeah, I think this is the way we got to go. So, yeah, thanks for the comments, the tips, the tricks, the likes, the feedback, and all that. Apparently, that wolf that charged instantly in the last episode did so because I had meat on me. I mean, I'm a walking sack of meat, but it was the moose meat I was carrying. Okay, now we have two choices, left or right. Oh, boy. Um, I'm just going to go this way. It seems right. Well, it's definitely right, but... Whoa. Okay, he's freaking out. <laughs> Equip it. Grab that. Yeah, it looks like we have multiple avenues. Just gonna stick on this path here. Keep your eyes peeled for a rope. Wow, these cliffs are super high. We should be able to climb them with our coffees, I hope. I don't know. Looks like we lost the wolves. That's good. Or uh, maybe not. Okay, I still hear one following. Uh, yeah, this is all burned up. Oh, by the way, the plane cargo containers that we bumped into but I couldn't open because I didn't have a hacksaw on me in the last episode. Apparently, they can have a lot of really good loot. So we might, we might go back. I'm not sure if it's going to be worth it, to be honest. All right, let's look for a... Uh, hi, hi, buddy. All right, we're gonna we're gonna get rid of this guy right now. Beat it! Scram! All right, that should take care of him for a minute or two. But we gotta find these ropes and get out of here. We'll leave these fools in the dust. Wow. Yeah, this uh, this force is completely burned up. I don't see any oak trees though. I still want to find some acorns. Oh, there's a deer. They're not so bad. Uh, oh, you know what? I never did. I, I didn't survey when I left the um, cabin. I really should have done that. Because I have no idea where we are right now. <laughs> well, well, I was gonna survey now, but we're gonna we're gonna keep moving with this flare in the hands. I have a feeling we are heading in the right direction. Gotta be around here somewhere. Hey, dear, is there a rope around? Uh, do you see a rope at the end of this ravine? Because it looks like it might be a dead end unless it swings around to the right there. Yeah, on the way back, we might try to get to that cabin that's up on the cliff side. So we might take a little detour if we can't get there we might just have to go right to the anglers den again there's the rope i see it um just to spend the night because what time is it now yeah, it's getting it's already late in the afternoon we don't have a lot of time to mess around we're gonna get super tired climbing these ropes too i think we lost the walls I'm just going to climb over here. Can we get up this little bump? Yep. All right. I think we can do this rope. It's not too high. Drop the flare at the bottom. Maybe have a coffee. Do we need the coffee right now? Might as well. We are thirsty. We've got three coffees. All cold. But that's okay. I like iced coffee. Delicious. All right. Drop the gun. Grab on and let's climb up. We're not heavy. So that won't be a problem. Yeah, we, we got this one. You got this one, Punchwood. No problem, pal. Three down arrows on the eye, though. That's a little rough. Takes a lot out of you. Saps all your strength. <laughs> oh, boy. Wait a second. Now what? <laughs> Is there another rope right here to climb? No, we can go this way. You done good, Punchwood. Excellent work. That is rope number one. There's rope number two. I can see it. I like how they broke up these rope climbs. 
So you get a bit of rest between climbing. That one looks like a long one, though. Holy cow. Seems longer than the one we just climbed, doesn't it? Oh my gosh, really? Uh, How the heck are we going to make it up there? Oh, look, there's a snow shelter right here so you can um, rest up. And some tablets, a sewing kit, and a heavy hammer. That's what you want to carry up climbing this thing, right? Big heavy hammer. Let's do a survey. I wish I had done this back at the cabin. But the cabin's right over here somewhere. Pretty straightforward, I think, to get back to the cabin. Not too worried about it. All right. Now, we're rested up. The only thing I'm concerned about is our energy climbing. Do we have an energy? We do have an emergency stim, and we have a go energy drink. You're going to get a massive headache afterwards, though, but I don't, I don't know, guys. This is a really high rope. Holy cow. Um, maybe I should rest for an hour here. I mean... The gold mine's not very far, and I guess we could spend the night in the gold mine. I mean, I want to rest just to save it, because I don't know if we're going to be able to make it up there without a stim or an energy drink. Fortunately, we have both, but the after effects can be pretty devastating. <laughs> All right, let's 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 do this. We're going to sleep um, for one hour. Oh, it needs to be repaired? Oh, okay, well, we can repair it. Looked okay to me. Okay, and now we can use it. Does it break down as you use it? Oh, there's the 100% right there. All right, let's use it. For, whoa, oh, oh, cool. What are we doing here? All right, this is my first time in a shelter. Do I have to get a fire started? Can we sleep? What do we do? Am I resting? I don't seem to be doing anything. <laughs> How do you use this thing? Certainly didn't save it. Maybe the fire needs to be started before we can take a quick nap. Okay, well, this is one for the wiki, or leave me a comment, let me know how to use this dang thing. But for the time being, I'm just going to sleep in my bedroll, the old-fashioned way, um, just for an hour. And uh, we'll save it and get a little rest before our epic climb. Okay, I'm back, and I checked the wiki on the snow shelter, and apparently you can absolutely sleep in them by choosing your bedroll or just choosing to take a quick rest like you can in a car. And apparently they raise your temperature quite a bit, so that's the whole point, is to climb inside when there's a blizzard or at night when you're cold, and you can warm up and stay cozy inside. Um, so, yeah, pretty cool stuff. Now, this is a super long rope. I think we need to drink this energy drink or maybe take the stem let's do the energy drink because it is going to fill up our belly a little bit too uh, oh does it maybe it doesn't i don't know it doesn't but oh boy look at that okay go grab on punch wood and go baby <laughs> that helped the eyeball but the hand is still dropping fast holy cow but look at punch wood go man this guy's on fire right now my son would be proud all right, keep going, Punchwood. You're halfway there. Actually, it's going to be close, isn't it? Oh, my gosh. What happens if we don't make it to the top before the hand runs out? Uh, don't think about that, Punchwood. Just grab on in campus, baby. Campus. A whale. Whatever it's called. I forget. I forget the lingo. My son taught me. I, I think it's campus. Yeah. You got it, buddy. You did. You summoned it. it, it. <laughs> oh, that was close. Okay. One more rope to go. <laughs> wow. That was a lot closer than I thought it was going to be. And now look how tired he is. Poor Punchwood. We have one more rope, buddy. Somewhere, I think. Now, we still have the... Okay, we still have the... Uh... Oh my gosh, there's another super duper long rope. This is... This what? Are you kidding me? I got to do this one too? Oh, we don't have enough energy yet. You got to wait... Now, why is that red there? Is that because I'm tired? See, there's a little red there. I think... Maybe we should sleep again real quick. I mean, it's warm, but what is this benefit we're getting? Oh, we have the energy boost. We definitely don't want to sleep right now. We got the energy boost. We still need this 
Okay, just give it a second. Give it a second. Wait a second. Grab on. Okay, go. We got the whole hand. And nothing but the hand. Now, does this rope look longer than the last one? Because we still have the energy boost, right? I think so. It looks like it lasted a few more seconds, but wow, the eyeball is getting super duper low. Alright, Punchwood, come on, buddy. You know at the end of this rope is a backpack. Uh, oh, no way. You ain't gonna make it. Okay, go down, go down, go down, 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 down. Oh, my. Okay. Uh, this is bad. What happens if the hand runs out? There's no way we can make it right now. <laughs> oh, no. <sighs> Headache. Oh, head. oh, yep. Yep. It hurts so much. Oh, it'll hurt a lot more if you let go, buddy. Stay focused. Holy smokes. You're going to have to be fully rested to My get up this rope. It's so dang long. Disappearing. Yeah, it did. Uh, okay. Let's put this out. And, well, there's not much we can do other than just sleep. But we're going to have to get something in the stomach. Get some sardines in there, I guess. And cattails. And we're going to have to sleep. Um, what time is it? Oh, my gosh. We're going to be sleeping. How long can we sleep for? Three hours? Let's try three hours, see what happens. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I always do that. Try again. One, two, three. Sleep. And it's headache is gone, sprain wrist gone, eyeball still really bad. Um, we can drink a coffee. It's not going to help very much. Is it? Not really. I guess we can do one more. This is the last climb, so let's drink another coffee. And we get some eyeball back. I don't know if that's going to be enough, though. Yeah, how do we get up this thing? See, I, I'm starting with only about 70% of my energy to begin with. I suppose we could sleep and get our eyeball back, but that's no fun. This is kind of nuts, guys, but we're going to have to take the emergency stim. Ow! But it's good. Go, grab, run, or climb. Look at that. <laughs> no hand at all. Punch was climbing without any hands. Look, Ma, no hands. I hope this thing doesn't run out before we get to the top. This backpack better be worth it. It's an extra 11 pounds of carry weight, so I think it is going to be worth it. And there's crampons here, too. But oh my gosh, what a pain in the neck to get it. Okay, you got it. Campus, buddy. Easy peasy. Now we have nothing left. We have no more stims, no more energy drinks, and we're almost out of food. <laughs> Drank all the coffee. Just another day in the apocalypse. My bad, worse. Um, okay. We still have time to get to this gold mine. I don't think it's that much farther, and hopefully we can just snooze there. I did grab my bedroll. Whew, okay. I don't know if there's any wolves up top here, but we'll find out. I'm too tired to think straight. Don't you worry about it, pal. I'll do the thinking as usual. Who drank all the coffee? We drank all the coffee, didn't we? I should have saved one coffee for after the stim. But, you know, live and learn. It's my first time. My first time climbing three ropes straight. And now we just have to find... This gold mine. Why did they put the gold mine way up here? Here it is. That's got to be it. I see something man-made. Looks like a, maybe a bridge of some kind. And there's a wheel here to go. Oh my. Uh, wait, is that it? I have to climb down now? Is this like a, an elevator? Send up the lift. Maybe there's a Oh, there's a rope. That'll come in handy. Sure. Looks like we're still climbing. I need an anchor point. What is that? Accelerant. It's I dusk. Don't... Yeah. So can't be far behind. Shh. Let me concentrate. Stop changing the subject. We gotta find a way down. Um, we're gonna need an anchor point. Maybe it's over here. I'm 
thinking it's going to be a stone. Wait, can I just put the rope on the wheel? I mean, that would make sense. No, you don't put that there. I think we need this stone to wrap the rope around. And maybe that's over here. But I really wish I had saved one coffee. I do have a sprain risk right now, and that's no fun. Can we drop something? I mean, we're down to 44 pounds, so that's not great. Okay, we just gotta find an anchor point. Yeesh. I don't know how we're gonna climb without any eyeball. Anyway, we might have to sleep up here. Let's go over this way. It looked like there might have been a way down. No, there's nothing here. Okay. Okay, we're gonna maybe get two hours of rest. We'll see what happens. Ooh, sounds like an aurora. Maybe the lift is working now. Wishful thinking. It's dark, but we got some eyeball back. Temperature's dropping. Oh, man, it dropped fast. While we are in there. Oh, great. Two down arrows. I did not expect that to happen. Okay, let's go find this anchor point. It's got to be around here somewhere. We're going to be climbing in the dark, in the cold, <laughs> and a bit sleepy. Is this not an anchor point right here? Oh, it is. Oh, my gosh. I swear I looked at this, guys. Mountaineering rope. Okay, we got this too encumbered. Oh, right. Of course I am. Oh, my. Uh, drop, drop. Drop. Drop all of it. I Are we coming back up this way? I don't know if we're coming back up this way. I guess we can eat some things. Just eat the MRE. That's a couple of pounds, isn't it? Yeah, I didn't realize this was going to be so much dang trouble. Alright, let's drink some water. We're no longer encumbered. Let's go. Too encumbered. Oh, I am still encumbered. I need to find some place to escape this cold. Yes. I know. Alright. One of these books and all the cloth, and hopefully that'll do it. Okay. Now we got it. Okay, this is a nice short rope. <laughs> nice and short. Yeah. I think we can get it. What is that right there? Is that the stuff I just dropped? Oh. Come on, Pudgewood. You got it, buddy. Oh, what are you doing? I'm trying to turn to that ledge. I thought I could grab onto that ledge, but apparently not. Oh, why is my hand all red? I guess because my eye is now red. How are we going to get out of here? <laughs> I hope there's like a stim pack in this mine. Maybe there's like a first aid kit with some stims and some go energy drinks. Otherwise, we're going to spend the rest of our days here, which won't be many. You got it, Punchwood. Just get those feet to the ground before you freeze to death. Or pass I'd out. Down right here if I We're almost there. Wake up again. Look at that. Almost frozen. <laughs> Ready to pass out from exhaustion. But I think we got it. Okay, there's the waterfall. And the mine is right here next to it. I don't have Never felt so burn, cold in my think. life. Yeah, I know. Hold on, pal. We're almost there. I think I kept the coal on me. We could get a fire going with the coal at least. Can we run a little bit? No, we can't run. We got nothing. We are spent. Right. Now, how do we get in? We drop the gun. I don't think we need the gun here. What is this? A hatchet. We don't need a hatchet. I could use a bit of wood, some coal, maybe. Where do we get in? Mining camp! It's the mining camp. Alright, let's just have a quick look around here. Maybe there's some good loot. We could definitely use some chow. Oh, here we go. What do we got inside? Anything could good? Could end up being useful. No, not really, but I'll take them. We can replenish the cloth that I dropped. Might need it to do some repair work. 
All right, that's enough out here. Let's get inside and warm up and find that dang technical backpack. I'm guessing the tracks will lead into the mine. All right, here we go. Follow the tracks. There it is. That makes sense. <laughs> okay, in we go. Traveling. Saving. We're in the gold mine. And you know what? It's an aurora right now here. Electricity. Can we turn up the lights? Turn on the heat? <laughs> Freezing to death. Ooh. All right, now we're warming up. That's fantastic. I don't know how big this mine is. I didn't really do any investigation work. Definitely need the coal. Here's a fire. This is beautiful. Long wool scarf. Okay. Actually, um, is that an accessory? I could use this. I don't think so. Where's my dang backpack? There's some uh, fuel, matches, metal container. Yes, we got some food that's edible. Oh, look at this, guys. We got soup and peaches banged up. Field dressing you kill. I already have that book on me right now. We got all that lovely coal. Um, we, we're going to need to sleep. Oh, boy. I don't know how big this cave is. But we're not going to continue until we get some shut-eye. Let's get a fire started. I will take the charcoal because I dropped all mine. One cattail tinder. That'll do. Get it started. Wow, what an ordeal getting here. I didn't realize those ropes were going to be so high. Two of the highest ropes I've ever seen. Insane. All right, let's extinguish this. Drop that and throw some fuel on here. We have a little bit of call. One hour and 20. And we're going to make some... You know what? Oh, boy. How much water do we have? I don't know. Let's make a coffee. And I need to see how much water we have left. 31... I don't have any more cans, do I? No, I don't have any more pots of cans. Although, what I should have done was... Alright, just skip that past the time. And... Oh, dig it. Yeah, we can get some water in here. Get a little bit going anyway. And then we can drop one of our cans down here, right? We just got some banged up tomato soup. And some new pinnacle peaches. Let's do the soup right now. It's at 49%. I hope we don't get sick from this. That would be icing on the cake in this endeavor. <laughs> All right, 12 minutes till ready, 13 minutes there. Um, we're going to throw on one more coal, and we're going to sleep right here when this is done. We have some tea, so we'll get a good night's rest, hopefully. And then we'll head into the uh, mine to find the technical backpack and the cramp ponds are down there somewhere. All right, pass the time. Eat it. Now we get another can, too, which is nice. 17 minutes until boiled. We better pass the time and take it. Now, how much water does that give us? So now we got, we got enough water now, I think, to get out of here. I don't know if we're going to need another coffee to climb. Because now all the climbs are down. Down's a lot easier than up, you know what I mean? But we could make a tea. Let's make an herbal tea. I already have one cup. We'll make another one. Pass the time, and we will pick it up and just drink it. Whew. I can't believe we made it. <laughs> that was close. And now it's time to sleep. Sleep right here by this nice, cozy barrel fire. Time is it? Oh man! All right, we're gonna get we're gonna get a good nine hours. Well, let's go eight because we don't have a lot of calories left in our body. Um, yeah, that's fine. Eight hours. Good night. Uh, where am I? I can't see. I've got. Oh, wait a second. Okay, I'm feeling my way around a hot barrel. Yeah, let's get a light going here. Let's get that. Lantern out, spark it up. Oh yeah, right, we're in the gold mine. I I, I forgot. <laughs> I 
I thought it was all a nightmare, and boy, was it a nightmare. I probably did everything wrong, but you know what? Here we are. We made it. So let's um, yeah, let's go in. Ooh, a piece of coal here, and let's find our technical backpack. That's what we came here for. Wet, wet feet. feet. Oh gosh, really? It's wet here? Oh, you're kidding. What else can go wrong? Look at that, Mike. But these are waterproof. All right, well, anyway, the Aurora is gone, so we don't have to worry about getting electrocuted. Because I do believe we had the Aurora last night. But, you know what? We were so tired, we couldn't really investigate this mine. Couldn't go any further. Punchwood was pooped. All right, here we go. Just going to grab everything that we can burn, because we might need to get a fire going. Oh, you know what? We should probably drink something right now. Um, man, we just don't have much to drink as far as water goes, but we got to get something down there. There we go. And how much do we have left? Eh, pretty good. Pretty good. I think we can make it. Now, I don't know how big this mine is. Hopefully, we don't have to go too far. I'm going to grab all the coal. We're probably going to leave some of it behind. Wool mittens. Don't think we need any cloth or anything, right? All right. Nothing here. Doesn't look like I can get up there. Let's keep going. Is this all wet? Oh, soaked. soaked. I know. And there's nothing I can do. Can you climb up on the rocks? Sadly, you can't jump, can you, Punchwood? No jumping. Yuck. It is cold. See some light up ahead. Uh, okay, this looks promising. Got some mine carts. And a heavy hammer that we don't need. Now, I'm hoping the climbing on the way back isn't quite as arduous as it was getting here. <laughs> I think going down is much easier, and I don't think we have to do any more up climbing. Oh, here we go. I see a backpack. Is it a trap? No booby traps. Excellent. I said it for you, Punchwood. <laughs> Technical backpack. Let's read the text. Read it. A sturdier backpack with all the bells and whistles. You can carry more gear before being encumbered. Heck yeah. Leave it. <laughs> you know what? I don't want it. Let's just leave it. <laughs> And a notebook page. A faded piece of notebook paper partly crumpled. Glad I had my good pack with me on this trip. Some chest pain on the trek past the high falls, but I expected that after the last surgery. <laughs> what are you doing climbing up here after you had heart surgery, you fool? Just going to hunker down in here until the storm passes. Tomorrow, high point at Wolf's Jaw and then head for home. High point at Wolf's Jaw. And a military coat. We already have that. And could crampons, baby! Yeah! Oh, look at all the food and water here! Oh, wow. We could have come over here and slept, too. Got a bed. Got the water. We're going to take it. We got candy bar. Hopefully it's edible. Oh, it is. Sardines. Barely edible. Peanut butter, please. Oh, God. Everything's really, really close to um, food poisoning. It's going to be close. This could be really useful. Oh. Placement fuse. Ooh. We, I wonder if we need that down here. I don't know. Don't know, and there's a ton of coal here. We just don't need it all. Military coat. We have a military coat. That one's all worn. Um, now, what happens with crampons? We've got them right here. Traction for your feet. Rope climbing drains less stamina. Dang it. We should have had these before the climb. Guess we could have made some, right? I think we started making them, didn't we? At one point, but we never finished. There's our acorn grounds. All right. Uh... You put those on your feet, I guess, when you're ready to climb. Look at these wet feet over here. I don't see how you can put crampons on here. Accessories. Oh, okay, here we go. Should I wear them now? Probably not. I don't think I want to put them on now. Because they might wear out. Just carry them. But, yeah, there they are. Pretty cool stuff. But we're going to take them off for the time being. And the backpack just just goes on automatically. What? What up? What's your problem? It's bored. 
Um, so we automatically get, look at that, another 11 pounds extra carry capacity. That is lovely. All right, let's just keep looking around. Maybe there's some more goodies here. Ooh, supply bin. Never would have thought to look here. Never, ever. <laughs> I guess we can use that. Don't really need the charcoal. Stump remover, no. We can't carry all this stuff. I know it's all useful, but we can't carry it. I know we have now 22 pounds, but we're still kind of heavy. And we got some climbs to do, and even going down kind of saps your strength a little bit. Um, time is it? I might get a quick nap right here for an hour. Yeah, I'm going to shut this off and just sleep for a quick hour. Oh, I lost the bed now. Bed. All right, I'll sleep for one hour. Good night. All right. Nice, quick cat nap. And now we can uh, bug out of here. I think we are ready to head out. I'm going to grab a little more coal. I mean, all this weight now. It's so nice. Grab it all. <laughs> no, don't break down the crate. We just want the coal. Not too shabby. Um, we don't need the charcoal. Now, I'm wondering if we should dry off of our socks and our booties because it's going to get really cold if we don't. When we get outside, I don't know what the weather's like out there. It could be really bad. Um, well, let's let's get a fire started and we'll just dry these off real quick. Uh, we don't have any tinder, but we don't really need it. If we use the fire striker, still 69% left in that thing. That's perfectly fine. Although we do have extra accelerant, don't we? Oh, we'll just do this. 95. Go. Yeah, we're going to need that fire striker for the, um, for the long trip out to the airfield. So we don't want to use it up. We can avoid it. But no big deal. We have a ton of coal. Let's just throw a little coal in there. And let's shut this off. And drop trowel. Uh, actually, Punchwood, you can keep your pants on. Okay? We're just going to drop your boots and your socks. Whoops. That didn't actually drop them, did it? No. That just took them off. Now we're going to drop them from the backpack. All right. So, that's great. We've got our crampons. We've got our backpack. I know it wasn't very exciting it was kind of uh, anticlimactic picking them up off the ground but well we got them <laughs> and they will be extremely handy i think i could have taken these off and then walked through the water without them on right that would have prevented them from getting wet but you know live and learn do we need any water or anything let me see no i think we'll get out of here just fine but while we're doing nothing we might as well make a coffee since Punch went over here, drank all the other ones when I wasn't looking. Ding dong. So I think what we're going to do next is just go back the way we came and get back to the angler's den. I don't know if we're going to try to get to that, that cabin up on the cliff because as far as I know, it's a long way to get there. We have to cross the entire Ash Canyon map and there might be some more climbs and I don't, I don't want to climb anymore. <laughs> I'm done. I'm fine with climbing down. I don't want to climb up anymore. Coffee's done, but shh. Don't tell Punchwood. I gotta hide it from him. Okay, the boots are just about done, but the socks are taking quite some time. How are we doing on time? I think we got plenty of daylight to get back home. That should not be a problem. And when I say home, I mean the angler's den. I'm clearly not gonna make it all the way back to camp office. We should probably do some repairing or cleaning or something while we're sitting here doing nothing. All right, while we're waiting, let's see what we got. How's all the clothes? Let's break this down. We don't need this. Ten minutes. Oh, by the way, these do not degrade. I looked them up. They don't degrade if you're wearing them, but they do slow you down. So we're only going to put them on when we absolutely need them when we climb. Seems to make sense. Let's, uh, let's try repairing this. 13%. Sure, why not? Got someone kid here. Just got to pass the time. Oh, oh, they're all done? Yeah, they're all done. Pick them up. Pick them up. Pick them up. And put them back on. Nice and dry. <laughs> Hopefully there's no more water on the way out. We'll find out. <laughs> um, oh, I should have repaired my bedroll. But, you know what? Let's go. We don't really have time for that. I'm going to grab a torch out of here. Save on fuel, and away we go. 
Okay, I may have missed some stuff. If I did, let me know down in the comments. And, um, well, don't bother because I'm not coming back. <laughs> don't even bother. We're never coming back to Ash Canyon. At this point, we just want to get to our final destination. That's the airfield. What is all this? Oh, there's a gun here. Nice. Revolver. Better safe than uh, sorry. 89%. I mean, we don't really need it. And it is a few pounds. I guess it doesn't hurt having a spear. Now that we have all this extra weight capacity, we might as well bring it. Can we just drop it somewhere if we don't if we can't carry it. But like I said, I think we, we're done with the climbs, the up climbs. If we just want to leave now and go back the way we came. There is a climb up if we want to try to get to that cabin on the ledge, but like I said, I don't think we want to do that. I don't think it's worth it. I just want to get out of here. Back home. And then we can uh, move on with our life. Watch your head. Low ceiling. And there we go. It's the way out. Leave the mine. Yes, indeed. Please be nice weather. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Yeah. Now where do we go? We can go back in the mine, which you don't want to do. Let's just drop the torch. You don't need it. Drop the gun. We don't need it. Um, yeah, it looks like we have to climb down here. Really? Oh, let's put our crampons on. Um, I'm not sure if they're going to help us in this scenario. Oh, sure. Sure footing. Okay, let's see. Whee! Okay, that's not so bad. There we go. Look at us go. <laughs> I guess this is the right way. Wow. I'm moving fast, too. I don't know if that's just because we're going down. Whoa! All right. Slow it down. Slow it down, Punchwood. I'm just so excited with these crampons. Now what? Can we just slide down this? Oh, 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 oh. oh my gosh, we're, we're, we're like literally stuck to the wall there. That's kind of cool. I don't know if that was the crampons or if that was just me. And here's a rope. Okay, so we came up this rope, right? Yes, I think according to my calculations, we came up this rope. Oh yeah, there's the snow shelter right down there. Okay, now we could go back up and then across the canyon to get to the um, that cabin that we saw, but I don't want to do that. <laughs> so we're not going to do that. Let's have, um, well, let's just have a coffee here. Not, it's not like we need the energy, but might as well. Going down should be a lot easier than going up. We have our crampons on. And by the way, there's a ledge right here. The stuff on that ledge, I don't know how to turn to look at it. Because apparently you can take breaks on these ledges, but how do I... Oh, I hit spacebar. Oh, what the... Whoa, 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 dude. Ledge. Ledge. Get to the ledge. Oh, I'm on the ledge! Oh my gosh. Guys, we could have just stopped here and took a break. It's about halfway. We could have saved on all that... Oh. Can't reach the rope. <laughs> Could have saved on um, our stim pack and our go energy drink. Yeah, whatever. It works. I mean, it wasn't pretty, but we made it. It was rather exciting, in fact. And man, look how hard it is. Even climbing down takes a lot out of you. Three down arrows. Oh, you need a quick nappy nap? Do we need another sewing kit? So many sewing kits, but we shall bring it. I'm going to carry everything now. Even the kitchen sink, because I can. All right, we got another rope climb, don't we? Oh, uh, yeah, it's over there. Oh, you know what? Maybe we should get a quick nap in. I'm just worried about the, the weather. If we try to get a nap in and an hour passes and a storm might roll in. And we're going to wake up to a blizzard or something. I think we should just take advantage of the nice weather. We've got one more coffee. Man, we went through a lot of our coffees on this trip. It's a little sad, to be honest. All right, got our crampons on. We're rested up. Let's go down. There's no ledge here for taking a break, but this is a short rope anyway. But that's a good tip to know. There's ledges on those longer ropes. I didn't know that. 
That last rope, I did see a leg. I tried to turn to look at it, but I, I couldn't. But I think if you just hit the space bar, it frees your face. Freeze up your face. Not freezes your face. <laughs> All right, let's get back to the angler's den. It should be relatively straightforward. Oh, we're going to have to deal with a couple of wolves here, aren't we? Ay, caramba. All right, well, let's do this before we go. I wanted to take a look at that other gun. And can we unload it? Ooh, okay, it had, had a few rounds in it. Nice. Two. It looks like it had two bullets. Okay. Weather's great. We're not too tired. Um, well, we are tired, but we can, we can make it back, I think, without falling asleep on our feet. We have a little bit of food, a little bit of water. In fact, why don't we just eat something right now? Uh, let's see, chocolate bar. I don't know if I want to take a chance with that other stuff because it's not in great shape. It's just a little under 50%. We don't really need to take the risk right now. Therefore, we shan't. All right. Heading back. Seems quiet out here right now. That could change quickly. All right, keep your eyes peeled for the wolvesies. Just get a flare ready. Should have brought torches. We have plenty of space now in our backpack. Kind of want to save these flares for the trip to the airfield. Now, if I recall, we came from the left over here, right? Eh. Uh, right. Left. Right, left. <laughs> Keep your eyes open for oak trees. I want some acorns. Yeah, I want to make some acorn coffee. Because we used up a lot of our big moose kicks coffee on this trip. I want to make sure we have enough. For the rest of our days here. You know, Ash Canyon is pretty nice. I mean, it's beautiful blue sky. Not too cold. The climbing's no fun. Oh. I hear howling. Yep. Oh, boy. Here we go. Here we go. I'm going to try to hug the right side. Oh. Still got the crampons on, right? Yes. Yes, indeed. Oh, we've been spotted. We've been spotted. Dag nabbit. All right. Hopefully, we can get down from over here. I don't know. Oh, sprain risk. Oh, we're heavy? Holy smokes. Oh, dang it. All right, I think the angler's den's very close. We just got to go over here toward the river. I think. I think. This is the way to the river. All right. And then once we get to the river, we just follow it right to the angler's den. Yeah, there's the big waterfall. I think we got this. Yes, a river. Okay. Just follow the river. I do need some more cattails. All right. I think we lost them. We just gave up. We got bored. <laughs> Let's get the high ground here. Yep, there it is. It's our cabin. Woohoo! We made it! Oh, so nice. Alright, drop the flare. This is a safe space after all. Oh, yeah, baby. It's like something is sapping my energy. You think? All that climbing? Maybe? <laughs> Holy smokes, that was a lot of climbing. Glad that's over with. All right, I think for now, my friends, we're going to call it quits. I'm just going to get a little bit organized here. And uh, we'll see you all in the next episode. We'll head back through Timberwolf Mountain to our final destination. Well, not the final destination, but our next destination where we can get reorganized and all that fun stuff. But first, before I forget, I want to do this while we still have some nice weather. 
There it is, Angler's Den. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. All right, excellent. Back in. And with that, my friends, we're going to call it quits. Hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time. Have a good day. Bye-bye.